Hi guys. So, you guys want to know everything you need to know about my job. Haven't seen my babe like all day. Waist trainers, and I got all the advice and all the tips and all the sauce for you guys. So I'm just gonna jump right into this video. So in this video, you guys want to know: Does waist trainers help with weight loss, and does waist training actually help your waist get small? And it does. It, honestly, it does. It really, really does work. So this waist trainer that I have here, I'm sorry if you guys can't see me. This waist trainer that I have here. This is a size 38, and this one is from Ann Cherry. And then I got another waist trainer that I also got from Ann Cherry. And this waist trainer, guys, this waist trainer here is a size 36. And also have just my J Sculpt waist trainer, which I think is like a size a 4X or like a 5X. I think it's like a 4X. Ugh, I got hair stuck in my mouth. What the hell? Um regular waist trainer so guys this waist trainer I recommend wearing this so I'm going to show you guys exactly how to put on the waist trainer how to measure this waist trainer guys I honestly recommend getting like a one size bigger than the actual size that you are and just wear it for maybe about four hours every day until you get comfortable and then when your body gets comfortable to wearing the, the um, larger size, then you can get the size that you want your waist to be. Because that's usually what I do. I'll get the size that I want my waist to be. Or I get a size up. So if my waist is like, let's say a 42, and I want my waist to be a 38, I would get a 40 until I can work my way down to the 38. Alright, so I'm going to be trying on this one. This one here is, like I told you guys, this is a 38. And this is and this waist trend is from Ann Cherry. This video is not being, I'm sorry, you guys can't see me. This video is not being promoted at all. This is strictly like just waist trainers that I love. Ann Cherry is really good. It's not cheap. I know you can get some good ones off of Amazon, but this one is $60. Or I think it's like $51, almost $60, $51 for shipping is like $55. But guys, like this shit really like sis. Your waist is going to, listen, your, your waist is going to be snatched. All right, so let me go ahead and put this waist trainer on for you guys so you guys can see i'm still working on my stomach so i still have a lot of um weight loss things that i need to work on so i'm gonna put this here matter of fact let me grab let me grab all of these so you guys can see so the first thing you want to do when purchasing your waist trainer and i got i don't know like i have like a weird little bump on my stomach or something. I hope you guys can see. Okay, so the first thing you want to do. This is uncomfortable, sis. I'm not going to lie. Have your stomach out on camera like that is very uncomfortable. But you know what? You guys want to know. And I'm, I'm here to tell you guys. So the first thing, you're going to measure the smallest part of your stomach. Which is whatever this is right here. So, mine. Oh, the joint almost pop. Now, this is not a good one. This is like the construction one I'm using because I'm being ghetto. But, guys, my waist right now, the smallest size is right now, it's like, I want to make maybe see like a 34.5 is like the smallest part of my waist. So, you just put it to where it gets up to. You want to put it a little, not too tight, but good enough where it feels fitted. So, this is where my waist is. If you guys can see, it's about... I don't know if you can see that. It's a 34. So that's where the, the smallest part of my waist is right here. It's about a 34. So now I'm going to measure the fupa. So you guys can see the fupa, which is like the lower, the lowest part of your stomach. Um, like I like to call the fupa area. So you're going to measure there. And so right here by my fupa is measuring at a at a forty at a forty-four. At a forty-three, forty-four. So if I was to order this guy, because right here small, I would get like a thirty-eight. I would get like a thirty-eight because this is this part is measuring at like a forty something. Let me remeasure that again. Sorry. So we have this here. And this is waiting. So we're gonna put this right here. So it's exactly here, it's 46, it's about a 46. So I'll show you guys, this hair is about, 
a 46. I hope you guys can, I hope this is like, it's focusing. It's not, it's having like issues focusing, but it's a 46. It's right here. It's a 46. All right, so we're going to put, um, let's put on the first waist trainer and this one. We're going to put it to the smallest, the smallest, as tight. We're trying to get the waist as tight as they can. So we're going to put it, all right, that's, that was, that's my new one. So we're going to put it on, sorry, we're going to put it right here. So this is a size 38, as you guys can see. I want you guys to see these sizes. I hope my camera, like focus in properly because I really would like you guys can't really see that good uh. so we're getting ready to snap this baby on so this is I have it here I always kind of like when I put it on I kind of like stretch it out a little bit so I can stretch out and then I like to put it from here, right? So it's directly fitted on, let me put my hair up. So that way it's like directly fitted on my back. And then what I'm gonna do, I start from the bottom. So what I do is I suck in, I suck in my stomach and I'm gonna start from the bottom. You want to keep your stomach sucked in as you do this. But you guys don't have to put it on the last one. You could put it on the first one. So, as you see, don't worry if your stomach comes out a little bit at the bottom. That is, like, totally okay. And then you just take this part and you're just going to go like that. So, putting this on here, and we have it on the third row. So I want to come and show you guys. It's three rows here. There's one here. It's a row here. That's two, and then three. So, we put it down. This on, and now your waist trainer is on. And guess what? Your waist is snatched. This is from the back here. If you guys can see, if you guys are seeing it. This is from the back here. So that's the waist trainer on here. And then you can put like a nice little, um, you can put a nice little dress on. It will show, ladies, it will show right here if you wear like a shirt that's too tight. But you can wear like a little fitted shirt and put a little sweater. You know, finesse it, you know. And look, it goes down all the way to the fupa. Ooh, all the way to the fupa area. It goes all the way down there. So this is a this is a size, this is the size 38 waist trainer hair. So we are going to get ready to take this waist trainer off. And we are going to put on the J Scalp waist trainer and that waist trainer is for working out. Oh my god. Again, this video is not being be at all. This video is not being promoted. And then like literally in no way did they ask me to do like any reviews or anything on their products. These are products that I personally use that I really love. So this right here is like a five. I think it's like a 4X or 5X. It's big now, but last year when I when I bought it, no, not even last year. I just didn't buy a new one when I first bought it. I just haven't bought a new one. I have to buy a new one. I plan on it soon. I'm buying a new one. Okay, I don't know what happened. But we're just going to go ahead and continue because it seems like for some reason we're going to record it. So this is the J Sculpt Waist Trainer. This is the 4X. None of these products that they asked me to promote none of these products. These are just what I recommend. So you just put it on. It's great for working out. It really gets your stomach super, super, super sweaty. And again, it goes down all the way to the fupa area. Pull my underwear up so you guys can see. This is the J Sculpt. This is the J Scott waist trainer. 
my hands up, back area, so you guys can see the back area. It goes all the way up here, it doesn't roll, so you can like jump, and then you know, you like do like squats. I'm sorry, you can't say, so you can like jump, and then you can like do your squats or whatever, like kick, and still good to go. So, we're gonna put on the last waist strainer here and then we could kind of like just jump in i'll just give you guys like just basic information about the waist trainer and this is my new waist trainer ideally i want my waist to be a size 29 but i'm shooting for a 30 31 so the next size after the after this size would be a 34 this is a 36 um will be a 34 so for this video you don't have to put it on the last strap. Like I said, I always like to stretch it out a little bit. And so here, like I said, you wanted to make sure that when you put it on, it's on your on your back, on the back part. So you're gonna start from the bottom. So right, we're gonna suck. Gotta suck it in. Suck that tummy in and we're gonna put it on the third row i'm gonna suck it in at this point now it is so this bottom one came unraveled a little bit so you see my stomach is still a little out which is okay it's fine. Now I can still breathe. I'm not, I ain't gonna front, busting a motherfucking sweat, but I can still breathe because this, we need this waist, snizz that. So you guys see that, right? Okay. And I wear this about eight hours every day. First time I seen it in So this is on the third, the third row. And this is her on. And I just pull that down, and then I can show you guys. Pull this up a little bit. So you guys can see the back. This is the back. So what we're gonna do, we're just gonna pull this up. And now we got this on. It goes all the way up here and it comes all the way down to your JJ. But yeah, this is the waist trainer. And now we can just jump right into the tips, tips, tips. All right, so we're gonna take this off. And it's, like I said, it's not tight, but I worked my way to the last one. Like, I literally, Work my way to the last one. So now it's off, and that's it right there. So now we can go ahead and jump into the video again. I have the waist trainers all here for you guys. Ooh. Don't laugh at me, guys, because I have on. I have on. <laughs> I have. Ooh. Because I literally, like, I have on two. Um, I have on two different. Ooh, let me turn this over. All right. Literally, I have on two different. I have on two different earrings. So, yeah. So, don't mind me. So. So yeah, you want to know these are all my waist trainers that I have. Like I said, this is the old one that I have here. So this one here is the old one. 
Um, this is a J Sculpt and this is a 4X. And this one here is the newest one and this is a size 34. Right now, I my, like I started my weight, um, my weight loss journey, I started at 314 and now I'm 214 from the last time I weighed in. And I do keto and I do intermittent fasting. But anyways, whatever. Let's jump into this video. So you guys want to know, does weight training work? Sis, it definitely, definitely works. Like, when I tell you, like, literally, I don't know why my nose, like, every time I do a video, my nose be sweating. Or I be sweating. But yes, like, like, literally, guys, when I tell you, like, waist training works, like, definitely, 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 definitely get you a waist trainer. I, it works. Like, it will keep your stomach snatched. How long, like, I want to say, like, how long does it really, like, how long does it take for you to see results? Because that's what I wanted to know, too. Like, how long will it take? for me to see results literally if you wear it every day for eight hours every day like while you're going to work while you're you know you're just doing activities around the house with the kids whatever if you literally wear that shit every day sis i'm literally telling you you're literally like in a month you won't see the difference your waist is going to be snatched you're, you're going to have that hourglass shape because that's what i'm going for i'm going for that hourglass shape so you're definitely at the end of the day why don't you gonna come up with that popping shit but like i said so Rule number one, like guys, like I said, I don't mind buying. You can buy a waist trainer from anywhere else. The only reason why I recommend Ann Cherry because their product is like that. The first waist trainer I showed you, the size 38. Like I was wearing that waist trainer when my waist was like a size 45, bro. Like literally my waist was a size 45 and I was still wearing that waist trainer. I didn't care. I'm like, no, this waist trainer is going to fit. It's going to fit. <laughs> okay, this waist trainer is going to fit. So it did my it did help like along with the keto and the intermittent fasting and the working out and my waist trainer definitely yes it helps it helps it helps a lot like yes it, all those things help all those things together in one all those things help so how long um will you see results once you start waist training and be hoping that you buy like a good waist trainer like don't go cheap like if you pay for something cheap you go it's gonna end up rolling up this stuff is gonna happen to it like I said. You know, buy either a really good waist trainer from Ann Cherry. And it's this other girl. I forgot her name. Um, Oh, Prima Donna. Prima Donna also sell waist trainers. So you can get a waist trainer from her. But Ann Cherry, their waist trainers are making made in Colombia. And if you know people that live in Colombia, you know them girls with like the Brazilian butt lift on. Listen, the, them, them bitches' bodies be snazzed, okay? It be snatched. Every, like, it be on point. So, how fast will you see results? You will start seeing results in a month. Like I said, you have to make sure when you, before you order, you don't want to order a waist trainer and then it can't fit you, sis. Like, that's what I'm saying. Measure your waist and whatever your waist is, if your waist is a 45, a 42, a 38, 29, 25, whatever your waist is, just go one size down. That's it. Go one size down. That's it. Or you could get the same one of your waist and just keep working it and keep, you know, until you get that tight feeling. And it's strapped on. Like I said, this one here, this waist trainer here, it has it has three hoops. So even though like this is a size, like my waist was in a 36, now it's a 36. But even though, well, 34. But even though you like I it's three. So you can start here and then start there. As it get tight, as it get looser, go here. As it get more looser, you go there until you need to until it gets too big. And you just keep going down, going down, going down until it gets to the size you want like as you guys can see and i don't know if you can see here all right so as you guys i don't know if you guys could see i'm not but look look at that like the stretch marks and stuff but look like this is my natural waistline and my waist it stays like my waist it doesn't change like my waist doesn't change. It stays the same. Like, that shit stays the same. So, one, you're going to see results in a month. That's one. Number two, you probably want to know wearing it under clothes. Like I said, you want to wear, like, you know, not something that's too tight where you could, like, literally, not something that's so thin tight that you can see. But you can wear, like, a loose shirt. You can wear a tight shirt with a little sweater over. If you're in the house, ain't nobody watching you, so you can wait around the house all the time. Listen, girl, you better be sexy. Summertime is coming. You better get your sexy on. Hey, get your sexy on. Get your sexy on. So, yeah, so one, you do see results fast. 
worried about wearing it under clothes like i said you know you can wear a looser shirt you don't have to wear a big shirt wearing it under dresses it's gonna give you that figure like you nigga, you gonna step out the house and niggas is gonna be like who the, who the fuck is that like who are you like so you gonna be on point but like i said just be mindful so you know you don't want it to show so you want to cover it up you put your little panty girdle under that one i have a whole bunch of panty girls i can't even tell you how much panty girls i got i know you got some panty girls comment down below if y'all got some girdles from macy's or some girls from jc pennies or some little faha that you wear under your skirt i think everybody has one like every Everybody want they shit to look like you feel me like look on point so um so we talked about wearing it under clothes it doesn't roll up guys the waist trainer doesn't roll up we spoke about how to measure also measure around this area first and then measure your lower your lower area which is like your fupa area get that measured and then you know you can either get your exact size of what your waist is around this angle like because you want to get it on this this is the this is the waist size you want to get don't worry about the fupa you got this you know suck it in that fupa is gonna go down um so we talked about that you gotta get a tape measure you gotta measure first all right before you either get your size or you get a size smaller one size smaller than your size don't go two sizes down yet just get one size smaller um how long do you wear it you could literally wear it about I recommend, honestly, ladies, I recommend wearing it every Monday through Friday because I wear mine Monday through Friday for about eight hours minimum. But when you're just starting out, you want to wear it. Like, just see if you can get through four hours. Just try to wear four hours consistently every day. Like, if you really, if you dead ass and you really want your waist to be snatched, this shit work. Like, I can't tell you how many things that I put on that the waist like the waist just does not fit but just because of waist training like waist training of course and working out and other stuff but it doesn't fit so yes wearing a waist trainer works works and no your bones do not get crushed and yes you can breathe and plus it helps you give you really really great posture especially if you have back problems like i said you don't want to get it too tight they have sizes from like literally 5x 6x 3x 2x 1x like definitely go i'm gonna put all the information down for the Ann cherry website I'm going to put all of that information down. But guys, that was my video on waist training. And does waist training work? Hell friggin' yeah. That shit works. Um, if you guys have any other questions or anything that you guys feel like I didn't cover, I didn't um, go over. Like I said, waist training, measure. Go ahead and first thing you do, buy it. If you don't got to take measure, you better go ask your grandma or your mama. And if they don't have one, you better go to a little Dollar Tree 99 cent store and ask them for the, the tape. Not the one I have, the regular tape measure. Get a little tape measure, measure your waist around the top the, the the smallest part of your waist measure how much that is but measure your fupa and then whatever size is the smallest part of your waist that's when you order your waist trainer either the exact size or a size down if you like if you like me and you work out all day and you're still on your waist loss journey i i'm so happy guys i i'm actually i'm officially down 100 pounds i don't know if you guys can see like my vision board like in the background but still i still got all this to work on sis so i'm 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 here with you like i am here with you like i feel it like trust me i feel it i be sitting crying don't ever want to work out don't ever want to eat healthy but you still got to get up and do it you still got to do that shit um so that was the waist trends that we spoke about i think i covered everything so in cherry guys check out in cherry don't go cheap on yourself. You're trying to get that small waist. Not you don't have to do surgery or some. Not everybody could aff afford surgery. Like I, like at this point in the in this moment in time, like I'm I'm working on it. You know, but not everybody can afford surgery, and I don't necessarily want surgery for myself. Um, but yeah, so definitely, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So yes, yeah, so waist training does freaking work. Let me know when you're gonna start wearing your waist trainer down below. And not listen, I got a few. Listen, y'all think I'm playing? I got a little, I got some few little. Listen, honey, I got some few little panty girdles that I can show y'all. I got some few little, some few little girdles I got. Come on, y'all. I got some few. Listen, I got some few girdles here that I have. These are some panty girls that I have. Come on, ladies. You better put that waist trainer on. Put on your listen, y'all don't y'all gonna make me put on my damn panty girdle because y'all really like you gonna really make me put on my panty girl because this listen sis I know sis I know like I know like hold on y'all because let me step out of my because I have my door locked. Listen, I know 
I know what time it is. I know what the vibes is. I know. See? Come on, y'all. I got, come on, y'all. I got the panty girdle. I got the girdle, ladies. I, I know what, I know what it is. So, I'm going to see y'all on the next video. If you haven't already, guys, don't forget. Please, please, please don't forget to help me by subscribing to my channel down below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell for the next time I drop a video. Guys, and make sure you guys leave a like, leave a comment. It really, really helps me a lot, guys. That shit helps me so much so um, more people can see my videos and more people can be part of our family. So I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out.